Hi, I'm Brad Cox with BradCoxWorkshops.com. For today's video, uh, it comes from a book I just was reading again. It's a book I've read multiple times over the years, but this particular time I got it as an audio book and I listened to it on my drive down to Vegas. I had a conference down there, uh, WPPI, had a lot of meetings with people, and I thought that's a good book I haven't read in a while, and it has to do too with the fact that I've been working on my sales video, my video course on just sales and how to make more money in your studio. And one of the biggest things you can do as a salesperson is to not be pushy. Your job is to persuade, your job is to get people on your side and to unite, right? And if people are always gonna disagree, they may disagree on your price, they may disagree on your suggestions, they may disagree even during the photo shoot of whether we go here or over there, even if you're in a particular spot, maybe they wanna be shot over here, but you know the lighting is better, it's gonna look better, they can't see your vision. If we just go over here, it's better. This is all sales. And here's the big thing is this particular book, you guys probably have read it, and I would encourage you to read it again, particularly in conjunction with my sales course. I think those two things are gonna go really well together. And the book is How to Win Friends and Influence People by Dale Carnegie, a very old book. <laughs> and I get a real kick out of some of the vocabulary and the terms and the words and some of the stories are archaic in many ways compared to today's culture. Yet, yeah, every single principle is dead on the money correct today, just as it was written back then. And listening to it as an audiobook, uh, if you're like me, right, if you have an iPhone, or I'm sure Android can do this too, what you do is you, you know, you buy the DVDs, and then you drop them in to iTunes, and you can set those in a, what's called an audiobook in iTunes, and then that goes to your iBooks. And at that point, you can then speed it up a little bit. And that particular speaker, I found that, uh, one and a quarter speed was the perfect uh, listening uh, speed. And there's like, what, eight CDs? So it's, it's a little bit of a lengthy book, but in eight CDs, you can read the whole book. And for that drive, I got about six of the eight CDs um, all listened to, and I finished uh, the other ones just on some jogs. Uh, but some really important points that I thought were really needed today, not only for business, but in just in general, in handling other people. And one is, uh, do we make enemies into friends or friends into enemies, right? And in thinking about this, like uh, I had a fun run down there and I was walking back with the, uh, the CEO of my lab and we were just having a lot of talks about, one, like politics, uh, uh, people in the business, uh, vendors and things like that. And some people are in many ways kind of antagonistic and they're trying to say, I'm right, I'm right, I'm right, I'm right. And they're making enemies of friends, <laughs> which what we want to do is unite. And it's not always as important to be right as it is to unite and persuade and to get people into your tent and your way of thinking. And this book has so many ways of making enemies into friends. And I feel like that's a lot of what marketing is about. It's a lot what sales is about, is getting people. It's like, you may disagree in some areas, but you agree in this area. So come over on my side and come over in here and let's unite and get things together. And the other big thing I really think is needed is showmanship, uh, particularly because I had a consultation with a photographer and her sales technique had no showmanship. It was just, I have this website I bought a subscription to and I shoot people's pictures and I just throw all these images on this website and I just let them pick on their own. And there's no excitement, there's no drama, there's no oomph to that sales presentation, it's just, I don't want to talk to you, get away from me, go online, look at them, maybe if you get around to it, call me. Right, and I'm a big believer in one-on-one -on -one sales and having some showmanship and having some emotion and all that, and we go through all of that in my sales course. So check out my sales course, and at the same time as well, get that book, How to Win Friends and Influence People. It's old, but read it, get the audio book, whatever, put on your iPhone, and do those two things in conjunction, and I guarantee you're gonna have big changes in your business. All right, check out my website, brycox, B-R-Y-C-O-X, workshops.com. And until next time, America.